Have you ever met an individual who always likes buying new things? They buy new clothes every time they go to the market. They buy new shoes, new watches. And not because they really need them, but because they need to satisfy an ego. They need to satisfy something which they don't know. Today they buy a new shirt, a new trouser, a new dress. Tomorrow they buy again. And some, even if you buy for them, they keep them. They want just to see them. In most cases, please do not judge such individuals. Because when you judge them, they'll be judged. Some of these people, and mostly, it's because they are undergoing what you call it, churning trauma. There are some traumas which was never handled. For example, if that person was a second born or third born, and their parents, when they are first born, has new clothes, they give the same same clothes to their second born or third born. If the new shoe, when the first born feel that this shoe is too small for them, they are given to their second born or third born. So these children who are given the clothes or shoes or items which have been already been used by their siblings, they have some traumas which, if not handled early enough, it is going to affect them even when they are married. You have a wife who every time they want new things, you have a husband who every time they are never satisfied with new things. Even if the wardrobe has new clothes, they still buy more. And not necessarily they need them, but because they just try to satisfy an ego which they don't understand. That's why in most cases are told that the blood of Jesus Christ will handle such issues. Because after you pray for them, they can even get books to read. They can even naturally get satisfied with what they have. Rather than complaining or rather than blaming them or judging them, just understand that these people, when they were young, they used to be given second-hand things or items which have been used by their older sisters or older brothers. So they try to compensate in the future.